So basically when I sat down with the doctor in the emergency room, they explained to me that since I had run through every treatment on the market, I could either try clinical trials or I could have an elective total colectomy or a total removal of my colon and then I would get an ileostomy. When Chelsea first came to see me, she had severe ulcerative colitis, which was deeply affecting her quality of life. She required multiple medical treatments, which unfortunately did not work well enough. And after a very extensive discussion with her, we took decision to proceed with an operation. But when I was actually faced with that decision, it was really big and it was really scary. Having a life again was everything and I felt like I didn't have one when I had UC. In surgical management of ulcerative colitis, there are three steps. The first step in patient who is sick and has severe ulcerative colitis will involve removal of the large intestines and creation of the temporary ileostomy. Then this patient will undergo second step surgery when we actually remove the rectum and create an internal J pouch made out of the patient's small intestines and connect it to the anus. Still, the patient will have an ileostomy at that time. Then, once everything is healed, that will lead the patient to the third stage when we reverse the ileostomy. At that point, the patient will start moving his or her bowels through the anus and resume normal lifestyle. Having the ileostomy isn't easy, but the one thing that gave me hope was that I could feel like I could go out in the world, I could go to class, and I could hang out with my friends, and I could like live again. Within several days after the surgery, Chelsea felt better, and the surgery was done with minimally invasive technique, which allowed her to recover faster. It was really scary, but at the same time, I was very excited to have my life back.